Hello everyone and welcome back. If you're new to my channel, welcome here. In today's video, I'm going to show you two solar racks that my husband and I built in a couple of hours. Each rack is built to hold five 200 watt eco worthy solar panels. Okay, those are the panels that are 52 and a half inches tall and 26 and a half inches wide. All right, if this is something you want to learn how to do, let's get started. Okay, so this is my outdoor kitchen that my husband and I built. We need to have power in our outdoor kitchen. So we are making our outdoor kitchen off grid. So over here is a gate to our garden. And this is where today we are going to build the frame to hold eight 200 watt solar panels. So we have the wood we need, two by four by 12 feet. We have four by sixes by 12 feet. We have our saw set up and this is where we're going to put our panel frame that we're going to build today, our solar panel frame. Three inch deck screws. These are hinges. Corner braces. Drills, and in here we have these to hold our tarp down to the ground, our square measuring. Okay, so next we're going to build our solar panel rack base. So the first thing I did was take billboard tarps that are used that you can buy online pretty cheap. I laid those out and tacked them down to the ground with stakes. Then we're going to put our cinder blocks on top of those. Okay, so we're going to take our 4 by 6 by 12s and lay them on our cinder blocks. Then on the outside ends of those 4 by 6s, we're going to screw our 2 by 4 that's 60 inches long. So you have a 60 inch 2x4 on each end. Once we secure that to our 4x6s, we will then put four corner braces made with 2x4 scraps or, you know, just whatever you have. So I just laid the scrap wood across the 4x6 and the 2x4 and I traced it with a pencil, the angle. And then I cut it on my saw and then we screwed it on to the corners. So that's it. And that is the base. It's very simple to make and you have very few cuts. So next in the video, I'm going to walk you step by step through how I made the solar panel rack top. I call it a top, but it's actually where you're going to mount your solar panels and then you will mount that with hinges to your base. So let's go to that part of the video now. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to build the top of our solar panel rack. Our top does lift up on hinges and is adjustable. So let me show you how we did it. So here's how it looks with slats. Those slats, you're going to actually put connectors to hold the panels in place. But let's look at the end. So on the very end, we put two 2x4s two together. So you got to screw two 2x4s two that are 53 and one half inches long, okay? You'll screw those together. You have two of them, one for each end. So you have one there. And you have one here, okay, it's right here, two two by four screwed together. You'll do that, and then you will take a two by four by 12 board, this one, okay.
okay and we are going to screw this board to these two that we screwed together okay so these will go on the inside like that so we're going to put screws here and we're going to connect it together so we have these two screwed together and then we have one long two by four by twelve after we get that screwed together on all four corners, we're going to add these brackets. These brackets you can buy at Home, uh, home Depot or Lowe's. They're like $3.80. You will screw these brackets to the corners on the inside. Okay. Once you do that, then you're going to measure your solar panels to see what the distance is is you need to have enough room for your solar panel to sit here that's why we have two pieces here so our solar panel will sit here and our bracket will be screwed to this part okay and then your next slat your solar panel should sit right here you should have an inch and a half for your bracket and then the next solar panel will sit right here so do you see how I have lines on there? That's where I was trying to figure out where the solar panel sits, where I need an inch and a half for my bracket, and then where the next solar panel will be right here. So you'll just go along and you'll mark it on the top and the bottom. Okay, so once I go down my two by four by 12 foot board, I will mark where this brace will go okay now notice that this two by four that's 53 and a half inches long is turned this direction see how it's we're using the wide side of the two by four so what we're going to do is we are going to put this flush with this and then we're going to screw it in on the top and the bottom okay so we'll screw that end and this end once we have all of the slats screwed where we measure for our panels we will actually flip this over onto the ground because it won't be on the hinges yet we'll flip it over and then we will put this two by four right here behind it see how it fits right there it goes all the way down behind it it's about I think 138 inches and 3 eighths is what I cut this long board at and we just screwed it straight to the back of those slats and it's like extra support okay so once we have our top slats and then that long 2 by 4 that's like a support screwed in behind the slats once we have that done we will take our lid which is the top of our solar rack and we will lay it down on our frame our base then i'm going to take a scrap two by four two pieces one for each end and i'm just going to put it here flush and i'm going to screw it down Put some screws in here, okay? And then we will take this and slide it up against it. Of course, this hinge won't be able to be applied yet. And then what we will do is we will go along wherever we have one of these slats and it marked, we will lay a hinge out and screw a hinge. So that two by four that we just screw down to the four by six, is like a jig it's to hold that top piece flush against it so that we can get the right distance all the way along the four by six for the hinges to be uh, screwed in okay so you'll also take one of these scraps and you will screw it on down here to flush you want to make it flush then you'll butt this up against it 
and then you will do all your hinges in the middle and once those are screwed in and nice and tight then you can remove this two by four jig and then place your corner hinges which would be this one and the one at the other end then you can screw them in okay so then our solar panel rack is finished all we had to do next was add some handles which you can buy these handles or whatever you have and we just screwed them on the corner right here so there's two handles there so you can lift it up and then there's wood under here to help prop it up and hold it at whatever angle or degree you want to have your solar panels at. So guys, that's how we built our solar panel racks. You don't have to build it like we did. You can build it any way you want or you could purchase the frames pre-made. This is just something that we decided to do on our farm. Okay, so I'm not saying that this is the best way to build something or the worst way. It's just the way that we did it. You can take it for what it is. You can use what we did and copy it or improve it or change it to fit your needs. It's up to you. I just wanted to share with you how we built our solar panel racks. Our next video will show you how we are going to hook our panels to our racks. So I'll see you then. Bye bye. Like and subscribe to Grandma's channel. Like and subscribe to Grandma's channel.